Hello everyone, this is Sue Broom and I am here to do the weekly angel card reading. This card just flipped out, I do not know what it is. Came out really quick so the energies must be speeding up just a little bit because it just kind of floated out of the deck and, and land. <clears throat> so this is for the week of September 4 through 10 and this is the Desert Speaks that's where I pull one card. And then the angels are everywhere where I pull three cards. And if you want to find out more about me, more about my decks, or if you want to purchase the decks, you can do that at my website, subroom.com. Also, if you're seeing this on YouTube, okay, that's the first angel card. I will pick it up. I don't know which side it landed. <laughs> I think it's up, so I won't look. <clears throat> I'll pick it up in a second. So this is for the week of uh, September 4 through 10, as I said. And if you are watching this on YouTube, please do like, oh, there's a second one. Like and share, and I would love to hear your comments. So, oh, there's the third, third one. They're coming out kind of interesting today. Okay, so I have these sideways, so I know that I have to pick that one up yet. Holding the cards, holding the intention that these are the perfect cards for everyone, no matter when you're watching this. All right, everybody, this is for, remember, this is for the week of September 4 through 10. All right, the Desert Speaks card, this is one that floated out of the deck. Oh, look at that, self-care, which is interesting because last week we had uh, compassion for self. So... It's definitely, we need to be continuing to take care of ourselves and remembering, you know, like uh, if you're on a plane and the oxygen mask comes down, what do they say? Put it on yourself first because if you can't, if, if you are not capable of taking care of yourself, how are you going to take care of anybody else? So you got to take care of yourself first. And the self-care, <clears throat> excuse me, the self-care absolutely is coming up just because the energies are moving fast in some, in some ways, there's the more that you can take care of yourself, the easier it is. I'm looking for the right words, because easy, eh. The better, the more apt, no, that's still not right, but it's the more you are able to take on other things. So, if you are rested up, you know, you can take on the day a little bit easier than if you didn't get any sleep. So really take care of yourself. The other thing that's coming up, and because I know the history of this picture, this guy, this little squirrel was hilarious. I was laughing, and yes, I was, I was very close to him. Get some laughter in your day because that also is part of self-care. What do they say? You need so many so many belly laughs in a day. I don't know how many how many it is, but I'm sure we don't get them. <laughs> so aim to get more belly laughs and more laughter into your day. That is definitely part of self-care. First angel card, this is the one that uh, fell on the floor face up. It is nurture your soul. See how that goes right along, though, with the self-care? So the self-care is taking care of your physical body, but it's also taking care of your spiritual body, your soul, your emotional body, your mental body. It's, it's an all-encompassing because, yes, we can take care of our physical body, but, you know, stuff starts out in the, in the mental and the emotional and spiritual before it even gets to our physical body. So remember the self-care is going to go along, right along, with the nurturing your soul, nurturing your full body. All your bodies. <laughs> Second angel card is, oh, breathe. And this, this, is, all, this is always a big part of it. <sighs> because so many of us do not take conscious deep breaths. I'm just going to say, yep, that fits right along with the self-care. 
And the third angel card we have is trust in who you are. So this, this tells me that there is, the more that you can nurture yourself, the more that you can take care of yourself, there's going to be some things about yourself that you might discover that you didn't realize or you've been ignoring. So it feels like it's going to be self-care, but it's also going to be self-discovery is going to be the week ahead. And there go the chimes. So it's going to be an interesting week. I would love to hear your comments on this. So thank you so much for joining, and angel blessings. Do you see you next time? Thank you so much for joining me today. And if you would like to find out more about me, like I said, go to my website, subroom.com. It's where you can, if you want to sign up for an angel card reading, if you want to get healing with the angels session, uh, if you want to sign up for my blog, message from the angels. Also, I have on my YouTube, I have been reading the current blog, so the current channel message from the angels. And I try to get it out the same day, which is Mondays, the same day that it comes out. So I'm just reading it. You don't have to look at my face. <laughs> you just hear my voice. And then um, I've been to see, and there go the chimes. And then on Fridays, I have been going back and reading. So I've been progressively going back and pulling another blog and doing the same thing. Because so people seem to get things out of the voice instead of reading it. So it's a choice but if you want to read it it's on my website sign up for my newsletter you'll get it in your uh in your inbox monday mornings every single monday morning angel blessings to you thank you so much for joining me and i will see you next time